Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Nandanavanam for another exciting episode of gardening. Today, like every day, is fantastic. Hope you are enjoying it. In one of my previous episodes, how to plant and grow flax greens, I've shown you all how I left some flax plants and didn't harvest them for the greens in the hopes that maybe one day they would grow back flax seeds. So here I am to share all the updates and learnings since then. For those of you who didn't get a chance to see the previous episode, let me make it easy on you and leave a link of that episode in the description and a screenshot right here. If you are here for the first time, welcome to my channel. My name is Pavan and I love to garden. As I garden, I make these episodes to help out aspiring gardeners take advantage of my experiences. Please subscribe to the channel to learn great gardening tips, watch interesting harvest videos and yum recipes with homegrown food. I have harvested the flax greens in about 6 weeks after planting them. Three weeks later, I started seeing tiny buds on the plants. Some of them also had these pretty flowers. With time, these buds, actually most of them, started blooming into these really pretty flowers and boy, it was some sight to watch these flowers dance. I kept watering these plants once every evening and left them alone to do their thing. And the rest is taken care of by mother nature and the wiggly worms in my tower garden. Somewhere in week 12-ish, along with the flower bloom, I've seen the pods have started to form. So turns out my hope shall come true and I can indeed have some flax seeds grown and harvested from my own garden. Wow, that would be some serious accomplishment to look forward to. Patience does pay off, doesn't it? Finally, after about 4 months, here we are, the pods have fully grown and are ripe for harvest. Let's get at it. There you go, that's today's bounty of flax harvest. There you go, that's today's bounty of flax seed harvest. The first harvest of the season. There are still pods left on the plant which are ripening. So there could be more harvest coming down the line. Mm -hmm. 
let me leave you with a quick tip if you have a plastic fruit basket that can come in handy you can run the stems through the basket and pull them out to easily separate the pods from the stem Did you know that flax is also cultivated as a textile crop in many parts of the world? Textiles made from flax are known as linen and are popularly used for bed sheets and table linen. Flax stems have fibers which are turned into linen. That is an interesting learning for me. While most of us do not have a textile to do that, well, that's what I think, but do you? Let me know if you indeed own a textile. For most rest of you you likely have a garden if you stuck around till this point in the episode so let me leave you with a tip on how to put these stems to use after harvest use these stems as mulch and or top layer in containers and garden beds i particularly like to use these stems as topping in pots after i transplant plants for example this squash plant This helps in preserving moisture and aids in quickly reviving the plants after moving them into new larger pots. I had another harvest few weeks after the first harvest and I could collect about quarter cup of flax seeds collectively from both of the harvests. A quick timeline recap. I've planted the flax seeds in late April early May which started to sprout in about 1 to 2 weeks and then I went on to harvest the flax greens in week 5 to 6 and the plants started to bud around week 9. and then they've started to bloom from week 10 through week 13 after the bloom as the flax flowers continued their dance i saw the pods have started to form in week 12 and ripen around week 16 which is when i got my first harvest and another harvest probably around week 18 19 so that's what it took the end to end growing cycle for flax seeds is north of 4 months stay tuned to nandanavanam and please subscribe to the channel also click on the bell icon so you get the notifications of my latest and interesting episodes thank you all for being with me today how do you like today's episode found it useful if you do not like it you can hit the thumbs down button and let me know in the comment section what can i do to improve the episodes if you do like the episode though smash that thumbs up button and by doing that youtube will recommend my content and channel to more viewers that is an easy way for you all to show the appreciation towards the channel and help me grow the channel and reach a wider audience remember i draw inspiration to produce more content from your continued support Happy gardening this is Pavan signing off until the next episode you all have fun and stay healthy by eating natural food grown in your garden see you next time